This video will show you how to sync your Easy Coordinator and BrokerSumo accounts so that your transaction data is synced between the two applications. Let's look at adding a new transaction. Only a few fields are required to sync a transaction over to BrokerSumo, including the address and the close date. But you can enter as much information as you'd like to get the transaction started. Once your data is entered, click the Save Transaction button. You'll be prompted to select an agent for this particular transaction, then click the Save button. Your transaction will now be saved in Easy Coordinator and synced over to BrokerSumo. You'll be able to see when the file was synced to BrokerSumo as well. Over in the BrokerSumo dashboard, we'll click View Transactions, and now we'll see our new transaction that we just added has been synced over to BrokerSumo. If you want to change the agent assigned to the file in Easy Coordinator, go back to Easy Coordinator, click the Edit pen next to the BrokerSumo logo, and select a new agent, and click Save. That data will now automatically sync over to BrokerSumo, and your agent information will be updated. If you need to edit any other details of the transaction, go back to Easy Coordinator, click Edit Transaction. You can change information such as the sales price or the close date, and click Save. And that data will be automatically updated in BrokerSumo. In addition, whenever you edit an existing transaction in Easy Coordinator, that file will be synced as well. Now that the data is in BrokerSumo, you can close out the transaction using our Commission Disbursement feature. You can add the escrow information if you'd like, or you can go straight to the Commission Disbursement tab and start creating your Commission Disbursement. BrokerSumo will automatically calculate the brokerage gross commission along with the agent's commission based on that agent's commission plan that you've set up in the system. If you wanted to add any deductions, such as a referral fee, you can do that really easily by entering a referral fee and the amount, and then you can select whether to calculate the commission before or after that particular deduction. I'm going to select after, and this will reduce the amount of the agent's commission based on the lower gross commission that we're now receiving. In addition, I can add credits or debits under the agent's commission as well. So this example will show a credit to the seller for $1,000, which will further reduce the agent's commission that is owed. Now I can see the net amount due to the brokerage and the net amount due to the agent and I can click Create Disbursement. My disbursement is now created, and I can generate a PDF to send off to the title company for payment. Next, I can go to the Pay Agent tab, and I can either pay my agent their commission using direct deposit, or I can mark the transaction as paid. In addition, you can also pay third parties, such as transaction coordinators, using the direct deposit feature. And if I go back to the transaction, click off the remaining tasks, it's now marked as 100% complete in BrokerSumo. Setting up the integration between BrokerSumo and Easy Coordinator is simple. Just go into your BrokerSumo account, click Settings, API Key, copy your API Key, then go back to Easy Coordinator, go into your Admin section, Click the Broker Sumo tab and enter your API key and click Save. The accounts are now integrated and your transaction data will now sync. Easy Coordinator and Broker Sumo now give you a full end to end transaction and back office management system. Find out more at brokersumo.com.